Ferreira. Melissa 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 Ferreira. Let's have two more first. <laughs> hey, why are you going to have so evil when I have two more first? Uh, she can go first. All right. So, Melissa Ferreira is going first. Everybody give it up for Melissa. <laughs> Brooklyn Blues. When I was a child, there was no match for my lightning boat energy, blooming magnificent mercy and masticated misery. The white light of my spirit, the moving bass breaking like a mob heart caught me up and whirling dervish turned tornado. This is what happened when soft, supple, brightly born baby meets brick after brick after brick of brownstone, rolling a tale of sorrow, hate, and hunger. I was a child with no land. A residue of roots, thus ungrounded, unfounded unto myself. It was no mystery how I came to be woven in the midst of treachery to spirit. How my innocence became ordinary, unknowingly raspy and needy, in a hard to world. That only really spurs a visual through the cracks in its teeth, calling it water. No wonder how my neck can snap a double take at every step, whisper and suggestion of love. In the midst of a culture that had constructed a shove into their grin, how could my aggressive softness ever win? So I caved in, became whole and shudder, a cavern in my chest meant to keep her hidden and hush her. Lilac of my spirit, lily in my valleys, I rally intensity as my own and only name. Call this the boy's game. I grew baggy and broad shoulders, the world upon my fertile frame became, became engorged upon a messiah that knew truth not. Became burning, everybody shine to shop, pretending my life when it was on top. When really, it was scraping the gutter, grasping straws, punch, punched in the throat and ravenous, a hellish yearning in the pit of my stomach, tacky and tacked, a sticky, sick and sweet, rotting the enamel in the teeth of my soul smile. I sold my smile to my mask, said this, per this persona is the only thing worth a damn, giggly and dangling over every precipice I trick upon. I grew strong in all the wrong ways, intellect was my commodity, willing and dealing in the world of packs, the world of packs, not, 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 not facts, while fiction was a metaphor into the unseen, held by a hand that had gone gangrene straight zombie. I cried out for my mommy, and though she wanted me, she needed peace more. So out of the light of this world's door, she flew. The only peace I really knew, I mewed on floors and banged at the shutters and heat and haunting. I write a lament for the ages, scribbling my poison onto pages, convinced myself that I was a sage of sages, and stretched my jaw to fit the world's maw into my gut. Some would call this era rut of the mutt, or tales of the one who didn't know how to give up. I call it ravenous and storm tossed, a stretching and snapping will of a beast who became a yearn to be released, a yawning, a tired trick, no longer turning, walking in restless sleep. I weep, I wept, I was weeping, weeping myself into a soft slumber, the substance of which I do not remember. And in the time of the horizon's rising ember, I stumbled into clarity on my knees, finally given up just to breathe. Wow. Okay. Hello. Is this a life? What? I am nice. How y'all doing tonight? Yeah, yeah. Can y'all hear me? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Can y'all hear me good? Yeah. Yes. All right. Hmm. This one is called America. It's loading. Hold on. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. I just had to pull it up. Start again. Come on, girl. It's coming. It's loading. It's my phone. There we go. I got it. All right. It's called America. America. 
land of the free. But who? Surely not we. Thugs, as they say, when we protest peacefully for equality, Black Lives Matter, <laughs> who was met with motherfucking army guns and rat a tat tat? Damn, more black man blood splattered. What happened to freedom of speech? Hell, we can't even take a knee. They will surely take your whole motherfucking salary. Now you can't even feed your family. America ain't that free. We can't even have our own black Wall Street. To build up the communities we come from that they fed with motherfucking drugs and guns. Now the neighborhood is no longer fun. Everywhere we turn, we met with the barrel of a goddamn gun. Not always led. Let me take a minute and get in your head. They blocked us from getting ahead. The second you clocking, bread, everybody wants you dead. From the haters to the white man commentators, reporting only bad news when it comes to us, never the good educated parts of us. I guess that's just life in America. Fuck us. Patriots. Had it been them thugs storming the Capitol like uncaged animals, there wouldn't have been no excuse for the police. Brutalical abuse. Rubber bullets mace to the face. Them damn patriots are such a fucking disgrace. Pissing and rubbing feces on federal walls, all through the halls of so many political deceptions. These thugs, I mean patriots, are so courageous. I wonder if COVID would take them out and do us a big ass favor. All them senators should, all them senators should thank God for Eugene Goodman. That black man is so important, but in America, us, his heroism simply won't even put America in the savage. Yeah. All the words, for Miss Savage. Give it up for Melissa. For real. For real. Everybody give it up for me. Give it up for me. Let me talk for a minute. Let me talk for a minute. Let me close. We're going to go ahead and start off with Miss Savage. What you got for Miss Savage? Melissa. I'll put those red times one more time. Let me just one more time. I'm coming. Miss Savage. All right. All right. Man. Hey, now, don't start. Back there. If that was a saw her, All right. Everybody get up to Melissa, man. Miss Savage? 